Hello friends, my name is Linda, this is Tyson. Um, for this week we are celebrating National Science with Nia Cynthia. And uh, for this year we are focusing on the deep blue ocean. So we would like to show you two different experiments where what is in focus. The first one, you need water and you need food coloring and paper dishes. So you start to put quite a lot of color in each cup, around six drops, like that. So that's blue, and we need orange, quite a lot. Take some more And in the last half, we need, I think it's red. Ah, uh, pink. It's pink. pink. Yes, we we'll sit in there. And then we need to fill the cups with water. Around half a cup is enough. So I think I want that. Orange and pink. I think we'd like to show them with the tissues. So I've just got um, uh, everyday paper towels. You can just fold them in half and stick them into your cups. So make sure, obviously, the paper towel is touching the water in both cups. Do the second one. So over time, the water will travel through the paper towel and it will travel throughout the cups. And also, we're going to do a salt water experiment today because to, we're looking at the ocean this week. So I've just got two plastic cups. The reason why I'm using plastic cups is because one's going to, they're both going to go in the freezer. And if you have glass, obviously the glass is going to crack. So I've got two plastic cups today for this experiment. So one is going to have salt in it, the salt water. So I'm going to use at least three uh, teaspoons of salt. Be quite generous. So that's going to be our, this is our salt water one. And we're going to use blue food colouring today to heat with the ocean thing. So I'm only going to do two drops in each cup. One of the salt one. We fill them both up. So there's our salt one. There's our fresh water one. The salt one does look a bit lighter because it has got salt in the water. Just give it a stir. Give the other one a stir. Okay, so this experiment is about uh, the density and the buoyancy of the salt water. So this is the salt water here. So the first thing that you can do with these two cups is you can get a cork and you can put the cork in the salt water and the fresh water. The cork will always float better in the, in the salt water because it's got more density and it's more buoyant, okay? Another experiment you can do with these two cups is you can put them both in the freezer. The fresh water should always freeze and the salt water won't freeze. It's quite interesting. And yeah, so give those a go and let us know how you go. Um, also, if you're doing experiments at home, just remember to try and take some photos and send them in to us. We'd love to see what you guys are getting up to. And um, yeah, stay safe, everyone. Bye. Thank you very much.